What is up everyone, my name is Experiment G and welcome back to the channel. Welcome back to Zombie. This is the final episode of Zombie. And we're gonna be experiencing the final finale. I skipped through the, 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 the dialogue, so basically you have to give the letters to the doctor. So you basically give the doctors to the letter, you give the doc the letters, and then you leave, and you get to the safe house. The prepper says, hey, what are you doing in the bunker? And, like, the whole, and he argues why, like, why you're not full, you're, like, whatever. Um, then the doctor basically tells you he got the panacea, but it was a vaccine. Like, for example, if we go here, so the doctor Knight, Dr. Knight's called, he's discovered the panacea. Bad news, it's a vaccine, not a cure. But still, I need to help him out get up. So... So, it's a vaccine, not a cure. So he called us over to get to the Queen Palace, Queen Daughters. But, we found we need security clearance, and he's not here. Then we have to find it in Buckingham Palace. But, we came here and found that. But now, let's go up there. But, as soon as you get near the elevator, you experience this message. Warning, no point of return. By taking this lift, you will launch the final sequence of Zombie. We're going for it, dudes. Now, better warning, I did try to live stream this game, but no one came, so shame on my fans. Shame on you. So, yeah. So I'm gonna be I'm gonna be recording my last place from now on. Alright, so as soon as you exit the other air from the jam, and the jammer time is kinda in. Hello, how you doing? It seems you can just hit it. Alright, the elevator's gonna open. Alright. Alright. So, you find a lot of. You find two zombies. They're gonna have nothing. All you need to do is shoot that. And they're instantly dead. Shoot that, they're instantly dead. This zombie right here is alive, so. Kill him first. Make sure you not get. No, 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 no. Don't get up. Alright, then you come up here. Uh, oh yeah, there's a bunch of here. There's a bunch of zombies here. Now, if you're going for the finale of zombie, this is what I recommend you bring. A lot of med kits, silenced weapons, and good ammo. So that's in my backpack right there. That's all I recommend bringing for it. Yep, that zombie's killing me. Okay, I'm using my pistol. We have a lot of pistol ammo anyways. No, 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 no. Let's try. Bastard. Those are spitters. Don't mind them. They're just as they're big too. I am really bad at the crossbow, by the way. I'm really bad at it. I lost my other bolt though. I lost it. But luckily we still have our bolt here. Alright, so we're gonna go through here. This zombie right here is alive. Kill it. That one right to our left is also alive, so kill this one as well. Kill this one as well. Alright, so cross over. Alright. So I hope you guys are following me so far. There's gonna be a zombie right here. Usually it will be our guy. Kill it, because in my live stream. Now, you'll see there's a bunch of zombies. What do you do? Go this way. Do not go that way. Remember the locked door we opened? Well, remember that door we opened? So go that way instead. There also is a zombie right here. Which is a perk. <laughs> Um, there's also gonna be a zombie right up here. Um, use your pistol on him. And also exploder as well. So use your exploder most of the time. Oh yeah, there also an is an upgrade right here, so um, I don't know where his head is, but I'm gonna shoot. Yeah, I missed that shot, did I? Yeah, I missed that one. Get away from me, Nico. Alright. They're down. This one's gonna have an upgrade on him. Aim plus some bolts, but well. If he didn't use both, so he would just have to be upgraded. 
because I only used it. Alright, here we go, guys. We're going through our boss fight. Here we go. We're going for our boss fight. This boss is insanely hard because... But if you go around hard for me. There we go. You might remember this woman. You might remember her. Say hello to the jammers. This one we encountered from the nursery. Just melee them. Okay. But whatever you do, do not get close to them. Do not let them hit you. They do take two hits off you. And then they're gonna respawn. Jesus Christ! See what I mean? They take two hits. They'll take two hits off you. They'll take two hits. Try to melee them as much as possible. Yeet. Almost down. Now, surprisingly, if you loot these guys, they don't jump scare you like the nursery. They don't jump scare you. But this one right here is alive too. I hope you guys are enjoying the video so far. If you guys are subscribed. Um, here we are. We're in Buckingham Palace. We're in Kyle's Kitchen. And of course, we need a hatch this door. There's gonna be a hatch door right here. We're gonna take off. We're gonna take one of our flashlights off. So we get a full battery. Alright. Alright, here we go. Alright, let's get our gun out. Let's get our pistol. Say hello to Dr. Knight. Dr. Knight infected version. Yes, Dr. Knight is infected. Oh, rest in peace, Dr. Knight. If anyone, anyone at this point, hashtag rest in peace, Dr. Knight. God. Hey, we got some styrofoam. Nice, we need that. Oh, oh, more styrofoam. So all we need to do is find the duck, we kill him, and now we gotta remove his eye. Remove his eye. It's sad to see Dr. Knight go. God. Let's see what the director says. The Doctor Knight says he discovered. Oh yeah, no, yeah. Okay. Oh yeah. Our character says some stuff. All right. So there's ammo here. Um, what I really want. Um, let's reload our crossbow for now. He has a sniper on him. How much? Has, how much does sniper do damage? He has four. And I have forty-five. Yes. Yes. We're gonna drop these. Well, we're gonna pick them back up. It's just I need to loot, loot. Because they will go together. Because they'll go together. I don't like my ammo not going together. Right, I think that's all it. Yep, alright, that's good. Alright, you're cool. Alright, now we remove this guy. There's gotta be also another zombie somewhere. I really don't know where he is. So, there is ammo right here. But sometimes there'll be ammo right there, sometimes there'll be not. Oh, he's right there. That's where he is. Oh, there's- oh yeah, right there. Wow, now it shows. Yeah, the items and the- yeah, the handgun ammo will spawn in different places, so pick up as much as you can of them. This zombie right here is alive. Yeet. Trying to get to position. Get something on him. Alright, time for our code. I believe I'm gonna get this on the first try. Six, four, zero, seven. Um, to find that code, to find that code, all you need to do is stand at this position. You see six, six, six right there, four, seven, like a zero, like a zero right there. It's a zero right there, and seven. So connect the dots, just connect with them both. And you get the four, six, four, seven, zero. That is your code. Sometimes it'll be different. Um, we're gonna place our last C4. Yes, that is our last C4. We place our last final C4. Say goodbye to C4, and we won't have them no more. Alright, welcome to the supply room. This is a room where a bunch of supplies need. It's gonna be a fire speed up the grade right there. You should pick that up along the way. Also, there's gonna be a mech kit right here, but surprisingly, I did not use any of my mech kits. We're not gonna pick that up. We're gonna leave that there. Because all you need to do is just save up mech kits. If you are if you are getting hit, I recommend to wait at health, like your half, like your half health, because these mechas, these are large mechas, by the way. These are large, like these are large mechas, not like uh, not like medium mechas. They don't hurt you a lot. But these mechas, I recommend to have them. Uh, Oh yeah, 
down zombies, don't worry. The sun, but I'm, I'm, I'm just using it just because to get rid of them. Because, trust me, these guys are a little bit annoying. Trust me, you really want to get rid of these guys. There's also one right here. One of these guys sometimes have items on them. One of them does, but it will, it will be most likely not to have them. Alright, all you need to do is go through here, go through the vent. I'm like speedrunning this game right now. Alright, so all we need to do is go down here. Let's turn on the flashlight. Turn it off because we don't need it. And yes, there was a safe house right here. There was a manhole right here. In the Wii U version, in the Zombie U version, you could not take the files underground. All you had to go back to the safe house and retravel back to the to the underground. Because sometimes it will be so. Sometimes you, but all you need to do is re-highlight it. In the Wii U version, you could not travel. Or was that another part? Yeah, that wasn't. Yeah, that was another part. I think. I think that was another part. I think so. I don't know which part of this. All right, here we go. Receive the panacea. So Dr. Knight is dead. Dr. Knight is done. Oh yeah. I'm gonna play the audio recording, so in, enjoy this uh, uh audio recording before I need, I need to do something for him. So on our topic on Dr. Knight, um so basically I found some information about him. So before I read this, um we found some information. I found some information about him. So once when first encountered, he will found an experiment on a human infected human. You know, I'm just gonna, um, I'm just gonna let the, uh, play, I'm just gonna let, a uh, text to speech play, so you guys can hear it well. So, I'll, I'll have a text to speech play right now, and explain what I mean, explain what I'll try to explain. So, here you go, guys, here it is. Hen first encountered, he is found experimenting on an infected human while wearing a hazmat suit in a bulletproof glass medical chamber. Here, he is looking for a way to cure the plague. He sends the survivor to go retrieve letters from D himself and a book written by Gesner, as he says they hold the key to the panacea. When you retrieve the Gesner's book, you'll find him in his chamber without a hazmat suit on. He looks to be infected, but gives himself a shot and the infection recedes, as the included picture shows. Infected Doctor he will then upgrade your scanner and begin to decipher the letters. After you do a few more missions for the prepper, you'll then return to him and will then send you off to find more letters. When they have been retrieved he will become excited and send you off while he begins to make the panacea. Later on you'll be contacted via radio, where he will tell you to meet him at Buckingham Palace while coughing heavily. When you arrive, you'll find him in the palace as an infected, which will proceed to attack once it sees you. You will then be forced to kill him. Once he is dead, you must take his eyeball in order to access the security door that leads to the flood chambers underneath, which, in turn, leads to an open vault which gives you the panacea. So, that is information about the dock. Um, by the way, there is a trivia here. So trivia: the doctor's voice by Tim Goodman Hill. Um, the doctor is for, for, um, simply referred as the doc. Uh, he only encountered once outside of his personal quarantine. Um, doctor seems to become infected after you leave him the first time. The hazmat you can see out bl blooded out of the chamber, which you can see right here, which you can see here. The doc seems to become an infection that does not last long, as you see in the game where he injected himself, where I did not notice. As an infected, I did not know this, as an infected, he can kill you in one hit. One hit. Which is insane, I did not know that. So, the doc can kill you in one hit. When you find Dr. Knight, he, there's also an armor, armored one, so by there, there's not much time left for Dr. Knight anyway, so... As the recorder say day seven, call for help, he turns into an infected. Which is kinda sad for him. So rest in peace, Dr. Knight. It's good to see you. Um this right here is and all the information you need for him. Some of Omega group still this door right here is locked, so you can't really go in there. So you have to go through the long way. All you need to go is right here. This door, this vault will open, which I've seen before. Day four. I have 
assisted the family is this gonna in the play for all? Secure area as the um, you go through the vents and stuff? Rises. This handgun ammo here would be it's it's pretty good. Personal interest in the alchemical panacea. Today, I will resume my work and perhaps thereby restore some hope of day five. The panacea work is progressing, albeit slowly. If only I'm gonna I drop could get into the library or call on friends who possess texts that would help. But, alas, testing begins this afternoon. Day five, supplemental. No panacea yet, but the tests have turned up an effective. So day seven, poison. where he said the panacea was. I will spend soon. today manufacturing syringes and encourage the guards to distribute them as widely as possible. Day six. One more day. The this is before the day where he got infected. Not gone well. None of the infected soldiers we managed to trap and inject have displayed any remission. Although it has definitely changed the manner of their infection. Oh, I to what end? Day seven, disaster. We're all infected. Yeah. Only the latest iteration of my panacea tests keeps I me and my family from succumbing entirely. But I will not shy from this task. I must succeed. For queen, For queen and, country. and country, I have discovered several entirely new vectors and pathogens through my examination of the infection. <laughs> yeah, it really is quite remarkable. Is there even a journal left to publish in? I doubt it. At last. Here it is. This I is day seven, by the way. This is still day seven. To begin my final testing of the panacea. This is still day seven. Science will triumph. I am sure of it. The family's condition deteriorates day by day. Even science cannot save them. <laughs> this is actually... Or me, I fear. Dr. Knight was a good character, by the way. Dr. My Knight was a really good character no back then. But now he's just gone now, so all we have to do is say goodbye. Finally. Yeah, this is where this is where he died. The panacea is ready, but it's a vaccine. But it's a vaccine. Not a cure. Not a cure. <laughs> but still, it must still give it to the world. Must be given to the world. I backed up the formula. Uh, I backed up the formula to the server mainframe in the Royal Quarters. Quarters. That's where we're going. Because now I must go to the surface to call for help. I don't know if I'll return. <laughs> and that is the end of Dr. Knight. By the way, through here, do not go all the way, I believe. There's gonna be an infected. There's an infected right here. So kill him, just one hit. The music is still gonna play, but all you need to do is find the rest! Goddamn, that scared me. Um, the rest isn't here, but they're not really gonna come out. Pick up the handgun ammo that's in there. So, the infected is trying, it will try to get inside, but they're really failing. There is one more infected right here. I don't know what's what that means for. It's so loud. Go through this vent. Go all the way. Or, go right here. This zombie right here will be infected. Don't wait for him. Just go through. Close the door on him. Open this door. Close that door. Wait for him. It's gonna be infected slightly. Him. There we go. And yes, that is an effective. By the way, off camera, I did this here. All, all is in there is an upgrade and some ammo in there. So you're going to want those. Alright, all we need to do is go here. And here we go. Granted. Hello, Dr. Knight. Hello, Dr. Knight. Here we are. We're in the, we're in the, uh, we're in the Queen's Quarters. We're not supposed to be here. I am bad at aiming, by the way. <laughs> yeah, he did not die. Kill him. Kill him. Alright, so there's only gonna be three zombies in here. One right there, one's coming out of the water. Um, right. Oh, it's a flare. Nice. I can actually use that for a while. 
Um, where is the box? This right here has queen letters. Um, you guys can pick those up if you want. I think I'm, do I have a flare already? Yeah, I do. I have a flare. But we're gonna drop this, and we're gonna take the flare that's off at him, because flares are useful. Alright, here we go. We're in the water part now. This is like one of the hardest parts when I, when I had it. So here we go. So go through this area. Oh, yeah. zombie right there all you need to do is just wait for him to come over here he's gonna be a really pain he's gonna be a pain though but just kill him he's just too good um don't mind about him um so that's gonna be blocked off go through here oh yeah remember that sound that's not the jammer it's the one that spins around there's an effect right there so I remember that jammer zombie I was talking about? Well, bad news, she is still alive. I don't know how is she still alive. By the way, once you unlock this door, there should be a zombie coming out through here. Yeah, there's a zombie coming right over there. Okay, all we need to do is unlock this. There we go. The door. Close the door, by the way. You want to close that door. Right here, it should be the last queen letters in the game. Alright, that should be the last queen letters. Alright. Alright. So, yeah. Once you put that thing in, the alarm will sound, and a bunch of zombies will come in. Just get your gun, and just kill them. Alright, guards are down. Alright, this is where a part gets hard now. Treat the panacea. That's a USB key. All we need now is a flare. Get your flare ready. Make sure I have a flare ready, by the way. I have your gun ready, by the way. That zombie's dead, I won't able to get that flare back. So all we need now is just to escape. That's all we need to do is to escape. But thank god I have a lot of ammo. Thank God I have a lot of ammo in my pistol, by the way. It's not gonna bother. Another flare. Good, 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 good. More med kit. That's good, because we need those. There's gonna be a zombie popping out somewhere. There's gonna be a zombie popping up right here. Let's try. So all we need now is just get the hell out of here now. Open the door. You're still gonna be in here. So all we need now is to get out. But these doors will close. Why though? So because once, because if someone receives it, like gets the panacea, guess what? It's over. That means you're basically trapped in here. So it means that you have to go the long way. God, that scared me. All right, keep moving, dudes. Just keep on moving. Do not stop. Oh yeah, there also is going to be an infected right here. Kill him. He's just going to have a he's just going to have a firefight upgrade, which is good for my shotgun. All right, there we go. So all we need to do now. Oh yeah. Do <laughs> long just dies. All right, all we need to know is go back to the safe house. That's all we need to do now, is go back to the safe house. <sighs> this is intense, by the way. So here we go. Now we, got, now, we, now we need to escape Palace Underground. Now we need to escape. But before I do anything, we're going to equip our shotgun. We're going to equip our shotgun right now. Shotgun's going to be really helpful for this. Because there's going to be a lot of zombies in this part. This zombie's going to be alive. Just kill him. Just a one hit. Because this shotgun's powerful. Okay. There's going to be a lot of zombies right here. Oh, that is a lot of them. Alright, let's...
let's just kill him. There's one. There's one of them. There goes two. Two's down. And we're done here. Nice. How did he not hear it? Come on, spit. How dare you two. Bastard. Alright. Yeah, they're gonna have valuable stuff out here. So make sure to take these on the long way, by the way. So take these items on the way, by the way. Um, take these items, because they're gonna be really helpful. I believe that guy has only... Ooh, shotgun ammo. Nice. We're gonna need that. We haven't used our flare yet, which is good. And by the way, this cake is still here. Which I never had games. Let's get rid of our med kit and take our cake instead. Cake's larger. So we'll have a better chance of surviving. Alright. We're almost done with this game, by the way. This is the final episode. Alright. Omega-193, stand by. Halo 60 live wait. So all we need to do now, just run. There's gonna be a lot of infected coming after you. Just run. That's all you need to do. Just run and do not look back. Just run your way there. Do not care about the infected. Just keep your shotgun on you. Just keep your shotgun on you at all times. There's gonna be a zombie right behind you. Do not mind them. They won't be doing much to you. <coughs> now all we need to do. This is the Ravens of D calling all survivors. London is now officially a no rescue zone, and firebombing will commence shortly. We've got time for one final chopper evac. Stock up your bombs and haul off to the Tower of London. So all we need now is yeah. Now we gotta collect gear from our safe house chest now. Now we gotta get to the safe house now. It's a no it's a no rescue zone. It's gonna be bombing. This London Tower of London is gonna be bombed. Alright. Oh god damn it, keep doing that. Remove this. We did this a long time ago, by the way. We did that a long time ago. And that's still not dead yet. It's awesome. It's gonna be an infected survivor. Him. Wow, we actually leveled up our shotgun. That's actually nice. And by the way, in the Wii U version, um, you can find infected people, infected players. If so, basically, if you're playing online, you can find infected players um, just by playing the hmm. game, and they'll have like loot on them. Sometimes they oh. don't. Um, but they have to die though, so you find infected survivors. All right. So all we need now is to do is stock up our bomb. That's all we need to do. By the way, manhole covers are not available no more. I repeat, manhole covers are not available no more. That's when you cannot use manhole covers. And I'm out of shotgun ammo, which is nice. So yeah, manhole covers are not available. So all you need to do is just run all the way back to the safe house manually. Not freaking cheating, just manually. Because manhole covers are no longer a thing. God damn, dude. This is intense, by the way. This is intense because we're surviving. Like, am I gonna beat this game on the first survivor? It's really hard to beat the game on the first survivor if you're just new to the game. But as soon as you play the game over and over and over, you know. Hello? Yep. This is Sandra from the Ravens of D. We just caught a transmission from Buckingham Palace. Is it true you have the panacea? Yep, I do. That's incredible. Please come to the tower as quick as you can. The whole world needs it. Alright, all we need to do is load out and collect our stuff from our chest. By the way, take a memory. We're, ta we're going back to memory lane of our old stuff. Remember episode one, where we've been here before. We're taking a trip down memory lane. We're taking a trip down memory lane, boys. Remember we went down this way to go get to the, to the palace to find some guns. And remember this, where, where our first encounter was. And remember, going up here, to get our first item in the game. And remember going down this way. Remember going, and remember going this way. And remember to go this way, to get our first bob that we had in our first gun. And we still have some handgun ammo. And this way is where we fought our horde. God damn. So many memories, dude. So many memories. Hashtag memory lane, boys. Hashtag memory lane. Here we are. We're at safe house. Alright, listen up, boys. Oh, I see how it is. 
You're all bloody plotting and conspiring behind my all right, back. Alright guys, here we go. The doctor, the ravens. You know what? Mm. Fine. Try to save yourself. Die in the fire for all I care. You're no survivor like me. None of you are. You're nothing to me. Go on. Go. Get out. Alright, here we go, dude. You people are no better than the plague. Yeah, this is where he gets pissed, by the way. I gave you shelter, weapons, equipment. I taught you how to survive. You'd be dead without me. And this is how you repay me. Mostly. Mostly. You needed me. Oh, you're all grown up now. Strutting off on wild goose chases all by all right. yourself. Sticking your neck out. But just remember where I found you. Trust me, you didn't. Sounds close. No, bloody crack at you. That's a problem with people like you. You just take, take, take like a selfish child. It's no wonder the country's gone to the dogs, is it? Well, don't you worry, because I'll have the last laugh. I will outlive you all. all right. I thought we were partners. There we go. I trusted you, gave you skill and knowledge. I should fucking kill you myself. Get the hell out of my so there we go. Prepper is after us now. We have to make her. Now we have a time limit. That's why the music's bumping. We have a tough time limit. Now we need to be quick. We have three more slots. We have five slots left. So we're going to take as much as we possibly can. By the way, don't mind about the guns. Don't mind about them. I guess we're not really going to use for you. Um, but do take some guns if you're really good with them. Like, do take some. Um... We're gonna take, we're gonna take like a bunch of mech kits out with us. We're gonna take just a bunch of mech kits. We're taking a lot of mech kits, by the way. So, that's all we're taking. It's mech kit after mech kits. Here we go, dudes. This is our final episode. All right, before we leave, we're gonna upgrade our gun because it's a more powerful weapon. And here we go. Here we go, guys. Let's get the hell out of here. Let's go. Prepper's after us. Now, we need to leave. By the way, that gun that on the part, this gun right here, guess what? This gun right here, we're gonna use it. Ha ha ha! Take that! So now we're gonna use this. Now we got, because yeah, there's gonna be a lot of horde. There's gonna be a lot of zombies coming for you. Just fight them off. I believe there's some coming. Oh, okay, good. So, just immediately shoot them. Because there's going to be a lot of zombies coming. So there's there is going to be a lot of zombies coming through this area. There's a lot of them coming. I see one coming right now. Alright, we got to go. Alright, I believe that's all of them. I think so. Yeah, that's all of them. I don't know if these guys have anything. Yeah, they do. They have fixed turret ammo. They have fixed turret ammo. A lot of them does. Mostly handgun ammo. Take them with you. Because you want those. Handgun ammo. Oh my god. That is a lot of them. Yeah, we, we, yeah, we just need to go. Alright. Yeah, because there's an unlimited horde coming. Planks. We don't need those. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Am I going the right way? I think so. Okay. Yeah, I think I'm going the right way. And there we go. Where we beat it. We escaped. Yeah. So basically, Prepper was there the whole time. Baby steps. Finish the game in chicken mode. Oh yeah, because I don't care about score. I just want to beat the game. So yeah, that's what Prepper looks like. Now he's gonna take our loot. He's gonna take our loot now. So anything in that chest, basically anything in that chest, basically, he has. 
So anything you left in there, anything that's in that chest you had, is gone. He has all the stuff we had. By the way, look at this guy! Look what he has! He has food! Look at all, look at all the stuff he has! And he couldn't share with us. Look, he has guns! Right there? The, look! Look at the stuff. And this is where Prepper lived. And this is where... Yeah, look right here. This is where he was the whole time. Prepper. This is where he was the whole time. And we did not know. There he is right there. There's the prepper. And that means he doesn't have us he doesn't have us anymore. He doesn't have us anymore. And look. Look what he sees. He sees the survivor. So basically. It's a loop. So basically, this is a loop. This is the prepper. Do you read me? Over. Damn. We're not done yet. No credits. No more credits yet. We're not done yet. That's not the end. We're not done. That's not the end of the game. We're not done yet. There's still more to go. So don't think you're leaving yet. But goddamn, that's where he was. So basically, it's a loop. So once another survivor comes in, and he gets out, it's a loop all, all over again. Basically. Come on, look, Lizzie. We've got to get out of London now. I made a promise to a survivor that I'd be back. I don't know if that's you, but you're on the same frequency, so hurry to the tower. We'll wait as long as we can. Now run! Alright, all we need to do now get is... Get moving, there's no time to waste. We're on our way. Our flash is about to die, though. There's gonna be a zombie right here. Let's take him down. All right, here we are. A load chopper. We have you on visual. Now move. These stones are on the roof. I'll light the way. Don't stop and don't look back. So kill as much as you can. Hello, guy. Hello, dude. What's up? Just use all your ammo. This is what we repaired. This is what we came. So make sure to have a lot of bullets on you. Make sure to have a lot of guns. He is going to light the way for us. He is going to light the way for us, by the way. He's lighting the way for us. So. Give me a zombie right there. Check that right there. Wait for it. There we go. And looks like we have no pistol ammo no more, dude. We have no more pistol ammo. 13 bullets around. 13 rounds left. No more behind us? Good. Here's the ladder. This is the end, dudes. We're about to beat this. In one go. Which is insane. Now, remember your flares. Use them. Use them now. Okay, if you don't, guess what? You're gonna die. Now, the reason why we didn't go up all the there, because there is a zombies. There is zombies up there, so don't go up there. Push her out of the way. Shoot anything that you see. You out of there. All right, so those are down. Okay, that's you. That's you. All right, we're good here. How much bullets do we have remaining? Like five bullets. Five bullets remaining. Here we are. Tower of London. Bloody tower. Close this door. Close that door because now we need to re-ammo. Since we don't have a lot of ammo no more, since we're gonna use our sorry full, we use our gun. We're gonna use this, we're gonna use- Okay, so we'll have our chalk on our left, we'll have our flare on our double right and our double left. Alright, here we go. We're about to use our shock first. We're gonna use our shock. There we go. And look who's back! Screamer's back! And looks like we're out of ammo, shotgun ammo bullets. Looks like we're out of bullets of the shotgun. We have to use our remaining five. We have to use our remaining five bullets that we have our pistol. Alright, let's use our SARS on that. What's up, Chopper? We're getting out of here. We're getting out of here today, boys. We're leaving. We're getting out. We're leaving this place. This guy is still alive, by the way. There's a lot of infected, by the way. We have two rounds. Two rounds left. Oh god, hello. I saw I saw that. 
You're dead. Sometimes there will be a zombie right there. Alright, here we go, guys. We're by the tower now. We're by it now. Once we fall down here and go there, it's over. Alright, there we go. That's the last bullet of the gun. Alright, now for our final alley. Now for alley. Leave. Okay, gun right here and our flare. Good. Alright, we our gun. Block door. We our gun as much as possible here. I wanna die. Alright, time for our flare, boys. Time for our flare. There goes our flare. Now we need to clear the tower now. Now we just need to clear it. And there we go! We did it! We beat the game! We did it, dudes! Woo! We did it as one survivor! There we go. The place is gonna be bombed. And there we go. That. And that is the end of the game. Roll credits! Oh, damn. And that is it! Game complete. Now, game is complete, but you have to delete. So, if you want to play again, you have to delete the game and start a new game. But survival mode. I'll probably, I'll probably do survival mode. Survival mode is like one of the hardest modes. But survivor, we did, we did normal mode. We did the game. We beat it. I'm gonna take a screenshot of it because, oh my god, I can't believe. Bg, good game. That was a good game. All right, roll credits. And there we go. That's it. What to say? Goddamn. Wow. Good job, yourself. You did a good game. Goddamn. Woo! What to say about this God game? I don't know what to say. What to say about the game, dudes? This game is amazing. Goddamn. This game was awesome. But there we go, we finished it. We finished our first let's play. I don't know what to say anymore. Woo! We did it! We beat the game in one survivor. We finally did it. That is it. The credits are gonna roll. I hope you guys enjoyed. And let's stay tuned for the next for the next let's play. I'll see you guys in the next let's play. See you guys in the next video. See you guys later. Good game. Bye bye.
Thank you.